So, another thing, uh, the, the wall lamps. I'm going to go with the black stain uh, glass pane. Um, just because I think it looks okay, I think it looks nice, and I don't like the faux block. And I know someone is probably gonna get mad at me for destroying this glass, but it's okay, I can get more. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm gonna go with this. And again, leave suggestions down below. Now this right here, uh, sorry, where is it? Uh, where is the uneven one? There's one there. This is the uneven spot. This is the uneven spot, I think. I don't think we need this. Can I have that, please? I don't think we need that light. So let's see, number nine, then it goes up, and if we go to number nine, go forward, then it goes to 10. I don't think we, we don't need this uneven weird one over here. So that's very nice, like so. Um, yeah, and then if we get rid of this one, switch this around, move that around so I can use it better. And then go like so, yeah, I think. And then remove this, move this, wait, what? Yeah, move that over, and it fits, then two, then it's gotta be two. Move this over, do that, move that, do that. Yeah, I think this could work. I'm tempted to move this one over a bit and do something like that. That would fit. Then maybe we could put another one in there if we really wanted to. We don't really need another lamp in here. Um, or we could choose, or we could put polish stand aside around all of them. Like skip this one, put and aside over here, put and aside here. Should there be and aside on every single one of them? That's the question. That is the question. I mean, looking at it just like this, I feel like it's too much andesite. Like, I feel like this, already this is too much andesite. I feel like this would be better. Um, I don't know, was that there? Nope, this was not there. I feel like that would be better. Because I feel like if it's too much andesite, it gets a little eh. Might even change this around. Hmm, I'm not a builder, I'm not good at this. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna leave it at this and I'm gonna ask for your guys' opinion or opinion. <laughs> Should I leave the andesite as it is? Let's just take a slow walk down. All right, All right, you're getting this. Okay, good. Should I leave the andesite like this? Or should I put andesite, remove all the andesite and only put andesite next to the lanterns? I'm kind of thinking about that, but I, again, I'm not too sure. Should I make the andesite go, um, should I make the andesite all the way to the top? Should I make it more? Because I don't really feel like it fits in either. Oh dear, it'd be raining. I might need to turn that down a bit. But yeah, I, I don't know if this fits enough, but I think I have used enough time on this. Um, I'm just gonna leave it as is, and you guys will have to <laughs> set some help. <laughs> some help. You know what, I kinda wanna try a thing. All right, this is what I'm gonna leave it at. And the side around the, um, around the lamps, if they are in the lamp, there's not gonna be an side unless it's like the part of the actual building. But yeah, I think that's gonna be the thing that looks um, the best. There could be trapdoors on that as well. I, I don't know if that would look good or not. Might as well just try real quick. Like add two next to each other. I doubt that would look good. So I'm just gonna forget about that idea. Um, I don't know about that either. Um, so maybe like replace the glass pane with that. I mean, that could work. The light would still come out but I don't know if I like that idea either. Let me know what you think about the, the trapdoor as well. But let us leave it at that. I think that is good enough because I do want to do one last thing. I wanna do one last thing over here by the Hippogriff. You guys have come up with suggestions for this place 
and I think I've come to something that I like. Except that I forgot my dirt. Um, hold, eh, hold on. Maybe I can sleep off the screen as well, cause it's, 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 it's annoying. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't like the lamps up here. <laughs> I have to say it. I don't think I like them up here. But uh, I'm gonna leave them for now. But yeah, that's also because it's, uh, it's like supposed to look like electric thing or whatever it's called. Yeah, I. I don't know if I like that or not. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, here we are. Finally. Alright. Let us do this really quickly. It should not take very long. I'm sorry if this episode is getting a bit long. But I did want to throw this in because I did see a bunch of good suggestions. Some suggested a shrine. Some suggested um, leaving this water up here. Some suggesting having a waterfall coming out of here. And I kind of combined, I think, all of those ideas. Um, I would like some more diorite. I would like some more diorite because I don't think this is enough granite. I'm going to make it into polished granite uh, just to make it look fancy. I have these for that. And yeah, I think I'm going to need some more diorite. Diorite sighted. I should be able to take this. Are there any in the cave that I can take? Ah, uh, there actually is. All right, let me chop away at this and get some more of it. Diorite acquired. Let us make some polished diorite right there. And then let's get started. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to make this. But I'm thinking... Uh, I definitely want water coming out right here. I want a tiny waterfall. I'm thinking like a waterfall. Then water going around. Let me see if I can envision this. Get rid of this. Okay, that. Maybe just do that for now. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Um, but I'm thinking... I don't think I have any more lily pads, but hey, we have the swamp right next door, so that's cool. I'm just thinking adding something cool here. That the water can go around. So just like chill right here just for decoration purposes it's not gonna have actually have a use that much um, at least I don't think it will we can kind of maybe make uh, I don't know should we make maybe that I don't know if that fits <laughs> or if maybe the polished and the side fits better it's a bit more neutral. Yeah, I think that looks better. Like so. Yeah, leave that for now. And then, of course, add water. Do I have water nearby? Yeah, I do. Okay. Good. Add that. I'm going to steal some from over here. That is infinite. Like so. And then I'm going to put it here. And just fill this entire thing up with water. And see what we are going to get. Put that there. And go all the way over here. Should this be enough? There we go. All right. We could even make it go in the center. But I think this is fine for now. Then, of course, I wanted this to go like here. Uh, could have moved, I could have moved it over a bit to get a little bit more like water flow over maybe. Mm, yeah, I might do that. All right, I have moved it and I think this is gonna work a lot better with my plan. So then of course this needs to be changed to something a lot nicer. And I think this maybe will make into Actually, if we make the bottom into, I think, polished andesite, so it's able to actually be seen in the down underneath the water, and then maybe make a ring around it, this border right here with the polished andesite. I think that would look pretty cool. So if we fill this up, just so it's actually visible, you know, so we can actually see there's something cool 
down here. And get rid of that. Get all of those blocks. And get that, and get that, and then replace the entire border. Getting along here. I don't know what we should have in the center, but it's not that I'm most... <laughs> I'm not worried. I was about to say worried about. Uh, it is not what I'm most concerned about right now, actually. To be honest with you, do I have the... Yeah, I do have the stone with me. I'm gonna actually move that up a tad. Just like that. It will still have that flowing down. I think I want to add a block here and a block here because what I really want to add is a secret entrance behind this and of course the water does not flow that way so that is perfect I could even do something like this maybe and even contain it further like that ooh you know, I, I like the idea of this. I'm pretty sure the hidden area... Uh, I'm not sure if the hidden area was a suggestion by someone. But I like this. I like this a lot. Does this lead anywhere? I don't think this leads anywhere. Does this lead out? No. So we have a little cave in here that we can actually use for something cool if we wanted to. We could have like a secret hidden... Uh, room in here. Of course, there's going to be light coming out of the... Ooh, I should have had glowstone. Yeah, I'm going to go get some glowstone in a bit. But, like, if we could... Um, I think I might do a quick... So no, no. Switcheroo and take that water back. But, yeah, if we could have, like, glowstone in here, change the flooring to something pretty, and then maybe have a chest with, like, the most important ice and fire... Block, um, not blocks, but like ice and fire items. So like maybe the, not the dragon flute, the siren flute, maybe something like that. I think that would be pretty cool. Now I do have to change the outside a bit. Actually, I don't think I do. I could terrain this a little bit, but I, I don't think I want to. I think I want to keep it as close to the original thing as possible here. Now that is of course going to be an issue, but um, I think this bit we can handle by just putting a bit of stone here. And maybe adding a bit of this. And yeah, that doesn't look too unnatural, I don't think. Maybe add that. Yeah. Ooh, I like this. I actually like this. <laughs> <laughs> Can I remove this? No, that's where the water is placed. That's fine. Then it's going to have a stone slab ceiling. How about that? I uh, need a crafting table. Need a crafting table. Do -do -do -do. Put that in the middle. We're not going to have that in the middle. <laughs> Don't worry. Um, I'm a bit upset about the walls. That I cannot change those. But I am thinking of just putting like making it only a one way in and then a chest at the end with like no walls out here but the, the room is cooler with them but i think i'm gonna try it because the way i see it it is not supposed to be something huge it is just supposed to be something that you walk into and then there's like a secret chest or a hidden chest over here with some items for example just just that's something fun it doesn't have to be great it doesn't have to be perfect um I think that will work just fine. I just need to get some glowstone. Um, I want some sort of lighting here. So I think maybe some glowstone or something over here as well. Maybe restore torches. Ooh. But then maybe a mouse will spawn in here. I don't know. I'll see. Let me get some stuff and sleep. By the way, just where while I'm at this chest right here, what do you think we should actually put in this secret chest? I'm thinking like important valuable stuff maybe i don't know about the dragon blood and this stuff i don't know if we should add that in there maybe i don't know let me know what you think but i'm thinking like weapons like the siren flute the ice dragon bone sword when it's not used uh, maybe the sea serpent scales because maybe they're 
rare, I don't know. Leave your thoughts down below. If anything, it could be a place for the siren flute. Because that's valuable and I doubt I'm gonna use it because, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, it's. I just want it there, okay? I just want it to be there. I think it's cool and a cool addition. I now have some glowstone. Of course I shouldn't have slept. Um, I forgot to bring some black uh, glass panes. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna put one here. I'm gonna add one here, one here, and then one here, and one here. Boom, 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 boom. I hope the glowstone isn't too ugly. Let me know what you think. If it's too ugly, I guess I'll replace it with um, with a red with redstone uh, with a redstone uh, lamp. But I think I think it's okay. I think it's not too bad. And then for this, I think maybe just add a glowstone up there. Then we can have like maybe some uh, shelves or something in here. Oh, shelves! That's what we're gonna use for storage. It's not a chest. That's shelves, I think maybe. Uh, yeah, let me go grab that, and then we'll place a water and call it an episode. Wee! All right, final touches, shelves, and of course need to update that. And then I just I just took an armor stand just because I thought it would fit, and yeah, we can we can put armor on it. For example, I might put this on because it's um I don't want to use it when it's so close to to death. I might. But yet, it does protect me quite a bit. So, I'm gonna keep it on for now. <laughs> and then, I think, uh, should I replace? I think I might replace these, actually. I don't have enough polystandesite. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. I wanted to replace these. So it looks better. Nope, I'm not quitting till I have that done. All right, I got it. Let's finish this thing. And I might wait for it to become nighttime <laughs> so we can see it in the night. Uh, I might. We might do that. All right, I think nighttime, and then we will wrap this up. I think I'm gonna remove this just to keep this. Nice and clean. There's a lot more space over here, but I don't mind that because the, the waterfall needs to go down and then hit this. So yeah, I, I like that. I like this a lot. I could also leave a water stream go down here. Actually, I'm going to work that real quick while I'm waiting for nighttime. And also a quick thing while I'm waiting for the sun to set. These guys are on 19 days. Six more days and these guys will be rideable. So that is... Exciting. We have one male and two females. This is cool. Well, I think... Yeah, we can read them, I'm pretty sure. So that's cool as well. Alright. Again, waiting for night time. Might as well put this guy up in his nest. There we go. Noise. And of course, still, leave your name suggestions for the empathiers down below in the comments. We need the name for this one and this guy down here. We need a name for both of these guys, so leave your thoughts down below. Alright, finally, the moon is rising, the sun is setting, monsters are coming out, and this place actually looks pretty cool. Let's put the water in and see it flow down. We can go through, there's no water in here, so we are nice and safe. It is obviously pretty exposed like that, maybe we'll add a piston mechanic at some point. Um, but I, I, th I think I'm going to leave it like that. Now, as I said, I was going to add this little canal or, I don't know, thing to go down the water here. And I'm just going to open it up like so. And, yeah, well, of course, I need to, need to of course, fill it up. Because otherwise, it's not going to go far. So just fill it up to here. And then it actually connects and then flows down into the rest of the water. I just thought that would be a cool little feature. Um, and then of course I'm gonna do that and then put that there. Sweet! You know what? I <laughs> I really like this. There's just one thing that we're missing. Bone meal. We need lots and lots of bone meal around this place. 
So make it look natural and cool looking. And hopefully a creeper isn't going to come up behind me and blow me up. Because that would be upsetting. Uh, yeah, put this here. Let it lead down to here. Do that. More like there. And of course this is not grown yet. But I will do that part once it has actually grown. Let's put that there. And then and do that there. Yep, I like this. I like this. A lot. Let's put some over here as well, just to make it look nice. And then this guy has something nice to look at. All right. I think this is going to do it for this one, guys. Yep. I'm going to stop bone mealing stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. That's going to be it for this one, guys. I hope you enjoyed all these small projects. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. And I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day. And of course, leave names for these guys down below. Um, and also, I see you, Creeper. I see you up there. And of course, leave feedback on the builds as well. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.